And I know they really wish we would uh, fall Till we fall uh, on the big bad wolf uh, There's a full moon Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an armor showcase of the Titan armor called the Retrograde and honestly this is probably the worst armor set in the game besides, you know, the uh, Vanguard armor for the Titans. I don't like that either and the lighting's pretty good right now so that's the reason why I had to do the video and my computer is not charging so this has to be really quick because it might die soon and I had to get this video done or I'm going to cry because, yeah, I don't know. And sorry about not posting a video yesterday. It was the same reason the computer wasn't charging, so I just uploaded the, yeah, like, like a video I had already. But anyways, let's get into this armor set. So this is the Titan Retrograde Armor, and you come over here. Oh, Retrograde TG2, I guess. It includes uh, Recovery, which is pretty good, actually, but you don't really need it with the Titan. For the Titan, you just need more Resilience because you can tank everything. And um, the helmet's pretty weird, honestly. It reminds me of uh, Halo Reach, one of the helmets in it. I think it's called like the Gunger helmet. I don't remember if anyone ever plays that game or like if anyone remembers that helmet at all. Which is kind of cool though. You can take off the, um, you know, the mobility for it. So that's really good. So you can have more tankiness, you know, you like tank everything. And um, yeah, I mean, so more recovery. Here are the arms. I don't like any of the Titan arms in this game so from what I've seen. Personally, I just hate how they're so bulky. That's my like my biggest problem with them, and you guys can see it just has like some mesh underneath, and that's like pretty much it. And uh, it's the hawk. If you guys want to know what the actual camo is, it's the hawk camouflage one, I believe. I'll show you guys it in a second. So um, changing this to recovery as well, just so we we can see how much you know recovery we can get. And um, so the chest piece is pretty much super basic, just like simple plating. And I'm sorry, this is, I'm going through this so fast, but I really. Don't want my computer to die on me because I had to put it into Windows Movie Maker and then export it from that. And uh, yeah, I'll just let you guys take a look at this. Here's the back side. It kind of looks like a jetpack duster right here. Um, that's probably what it is, honestly. I don't know, though. Maybe it's just like some latches to hold on to it. And um, yeah, I mean, <clears throat> it really sucks when your computer's going to die on you and you're like trying to get the video done, you know? Uh, it's like this armor set's really like it's personally like I don't know what to say about it besides like it looks like the the what did I call it? The homeless hunter set so this had to be like a broke down robot you know with the titan stuff so i actually do like the legs the legs are probably my favorite part of this ar entire armor set i don't like the mark at all but i was using it earlier um with another build and it was the troll build that i did which i don't know if you guys have ever seen that it was in one of my other videos with the titan i can't remember which one though and uh yeah i mean i like the the pants that's about it dude um the the mark honestly i don't really like any of the marks in this game either i feel like they just don't like they don't look that good in my opinion versus like some of them where like they like um are really different most of them are just pretty much this thing where it just kind of hangs down from the side and that's about it and it just seems like there's no point in them at all but i don't know i mean the hunter cloak makes kind of more sense and then the warlock band doesn't really make so much sense because it's so small but i mean what else could you put on them i guess i don't know and um yeah now we're just going to uh spin around about twice you know so you guys can see it. You guys slow it down with the YouTube playback if you want. And uh, yeah, I mean we're at three minutes right now, and I'm trying to get this done. So now we're gonna look at uh, you know some shaders. We're gonna look at the Iron Battalion just because I actually like this shader sometimes. And I have not seen this armor set with any shaders. Actually, that's not bad at all. Wow, that actually looks really really good. Besides the the mark, I don't like how that's always blue. So you have to match something with that. That actually looked really good. The Iron Battalion. Now we're going to Xeno Silver because I usually like this one as well. This is probably like one of my favorite shaders in the game now. Just because, like, I don't know. And this one kind of matches the blue of this. And if you didn't know, you guys could see that Mina Multics one now has Xeno Silver on it. And you can do that with all exotics. I don't understand why you can see them, but you can't, you know, equip it. You can only equip accessories and stuff like that. And now we're going to go to Nebula Rose for the more feminine people and stuff like that. You know, like anyone who likes the girlier colors. I actually like this armor set too, just because uh, white and purple looks really nice. Plus it's shiny. It's got a pink undertone and looks really nice. And, uh, yeah, I mean, this is probably one of, what, is this my fastest, um armor showcase or no i can't tell i don't really keep track of how much time i usually have this one's pretty nice too gold and silver i don't like how shiny it looks kind of looks like plasticky personally but um yeah i don't know now we're gonna go to the new monarchy diamonds we're just gonna look at this one come on actually this one's really nice too okay so with shaders this thing doesn't look that bad to be honest like it actually makes it look way better so a default shader kind of looks like the broke down robot if you want to look super you know cool and stuff like that you just gotta throw on a shader any shader pretty much from what i've seen so far 
and he's shiny shader. So this is pretty much like the super HD version of him versus like uh, when he's all broke down, you know, looking. Oh, this is the shader that's actually the one that's default on him. If you wanted to make him look not so old, but keep the same thing. See, so it just makes it so the um, thing doesn't look all scratched up and beaten and worn and stuff like that. So, I mean, if you want to make him look kind of better, then there you go. That's how you do it. And now we're going to go to Cal Shader or Cal Selected, which I don't really like on this one. Um, so I'm going to skip it. And we're going to go to the Modular Shine, Suros Modular Shine, because I actually like this one too sometimes. And no, I don't really like this one. I think it's when this thing is white, it kind of throws it off because it still looks kind of beaten up. And that's what like I hate about the armor sets when it looks beaten up like that because it just makes me not want to use it because why would I use something that looks already, you know, junk? And then like this looks plastic as well. Metro Shift I usually like, so hopefully it can pull through, you know. Um... Okay, so this one's pretty good too. See, this one's not a bad shader either. Plus, this just is all blue. So, I mean, it actually does throw it all together. So, I like this one. This one's pretty nice. And then, let's do like two more. Let's do Arctic Pearl. No. Let's go to uh, Fromulus, because why not? I wish I had Watermelon just to see what it would look like on this. So, no, not Fromulus. I think any of the silver ones are kind of bad. Let's go to Bumblebee. Screw it. We're going to end it off on Bumblebee and... Yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, wow, wow, okay. Um, was not expecting that. I was expecting it to be black, so actually let me change to this one. Okay, anyways, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys did like it, I'm sorry that it was super quick and super fast, stuff like that. But if you did enjoy it, please hit that like button. Subscribe for daily Destiny 2 videos besides yesterday's video, which is a music video because, you know, my computer's messing up and I hope that I can get it fixed, hope, like, soon. But anyways, that's pretty much it for the video. I'll see you guys all tomorrow for another video.